New at five, the fight to put mental health first in dangerous crisis situations in Colorado Springs. That is the message from the city council from the new law enforcement transparency and accountability commission. The commission was created after summer's protests here following the murder of George Floyd at the hands of a Minnesota police officer. Carradio News Channel 13 Scott Harrison sat in on today's council work session. He is live now at the police operations center where many of those protests happened last year. Scott. Well, the city's four hit four crisis teams are headquartered here at the police operations center. Each consists of a police officer, a paramedic, a social worker, and a mental health professional. Now, th those teams respond to 911 calls in which someone is emotionally upset or has mental health issues. Today, the city council listened to why more teams are needed. This training from two years ago in the Springs shows the kinds of crisis situations handled by the crisis teams. A member of the Law Enforcement Transparency and Accountability Commission says that the city's growth and the growing number of calls justifies the need for more teams. We do believe that there is an unmet need there and we're encouraging the partners who are currently involved to have additional conversations um, and to present to the administrative side uh, what a reasonable expansion would look like. Although the new commission is making the recommendation to the council, it's only a recommendation, but one that some commissioners and some council members feel could have been stronger and more detailed. The commission's recommendation does not specify how many more community response teams are needed and how much it will cost to create them, instead leaving that matter up to the city council and the police department. Council members say that they do support the idea and they will include it in the upcoming budget process for next year. The mayor's office, not the council, oversees the police department. Chief of Staff Jeff Green says that the mayor also supports giving the matter further consideration. And since the council appointed the commission, some council members want to see that the recommendation gets sufficient attention. If for some odd reason, you choose not to, uh, I would like a detailed explanation during the budget hearing as to why or in advance of the budget hearing. Now, while seeking more resources, the commission also wants to use resources wisely, saying that an entire four-person crisis team isn't always needed to resolve a situation. It's a story we'll keep following for you. Live at the Police Operations Center in Colorado Springs, Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.